I'm going to check voltage in the battery. I see we got a, a breaker here. Or actually, it's a, some kind of fuse. It's a it's a bus bus big old hundred amp. Uh, I think it's a hundred amp fuse right here. Welcome back to the Hillbilly RV channel. Uh, got a special treat for you today. We're going on airstream. We never work on airstreams. Uh, we just don't. I, I mean, I just don't get many calls on. But uh, this one is electrical. Um, now here's, you know, I just done a video very recently on basically this subject. Um, these folks said they were in another state last week and they were having trouble. The batteries weren't being charged. Uh, as long as they're plugged into uh, shore cord, all the 12 volt stuff in the coach works. But when they unplug, the batteries are dead. So they called a guy, he come out and replaced the converter. Well, shocker, didn't fix it because there ain't nothing wrong with the converter. If you got 12 volt in the coach when you're plugged into shore power, then there's nothing wrong with the converter. <laughs> you know, you've got a battery issue. The power is not making it from the converter to the battery. So let's see if we can figure out what's wrong with this one. Is it going to be the same as that last one? I don't know. We're going to find out. I'm going to check voltage in the battery. I see we got a, a breaker here. Or actually, it's a, some kind of fuse. It's a it's a bus bus big old hundred amp. Uh, I think it's a hundred amp fuse right here. So let me get my meter set up. I'm gonna try and get y'all set up here somewhere. All right. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> I know you're kind of precarious there. Please. Uh, don't y'all fall off there if you do. Yeah, brace for impact. Oh, let me get my meter out here. Let's get her on the DC scale. Just like so. Let's go ahead. Catch us a ground right here on the batteries. Okay. Can y'all see the meter okay? Hope so. I won't know till I'm editing. Let's just start checking powers here. The two volts. We got 14 volts. <laughs> I think we found the problem already, lady. This fuse here is bad. Uh, you know, the batteries don't have two volts in them, but here we got 14.6 coming in. It's just not making it. Let me double check here. Yeah, it's coming, coming from the converter, and maybe there's solar. They got a pretty good bit of solar. I think he said. Um, I don't know how many watts, but uh, I looked at the I looked at the monitor panel in there, and it's uh, you know the solar panels. Well, I don't know whether it's solar or the converter, but yeah, I saw the 14.6. It should be coming into these batteries, and it's not. And I expect this wire here probably goes back to the converter. I would assume. Uh, well, no, this one's coming to the converter. I honestly don't know. Where, where this cable is going, but I do know there's a there's a big copper brass uh, bar that comes right out of this fuse, right straight to the batteries. Um, we got other fuses and stuff, other places, but I don't think it matters because I have already found the problem. Y'all can see that 14.6. The other post, we got battery voltage. So, uh, yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna do here, folks. I do not have a fuse like that. Um, I might just have to show these people what the problem is, and uh, I don't know how long they're gonna be here. Maybe I can, maybe I can get a, a fuse. I don't know. But anyhow, that was. Uh, Well, that was like super quick and dirty. Um, 
Uh, so it was uh, the exact same problem. Well, very near the same problem as that last one I did uh, that I assumed was going to be a converter. Now, these folks here done paid for a converter that they did not need. So they got a spare now, which ain't a bad thing. So, uh, you know, don't y'all uh, don't y'all you lose your spare. Uh, get down in that comment section. Leave me a comment, a criticism, a concern. I'm going to go in and talk to these folks real quick. And uh, we're going to discuss what we're going to do. And we'll all move on. Y'all have a great day. Thank you.